little suction thing for sure. Wow. It works. Let's see. <laughs> um, we haven't been to the two flat in like, I haven't been in probably a month. And it's been two weeks for me probably. Um, so we are on our way there now to meet with our architect and I'm not even honestly sure why. <laughs> why? <laughs> we have to make we have to make a lot of decisions and we have to just check on progress of plumbing, electrical, HVAC. There's been a lot going on that you'll never ever see. Is the electrical in? I think that he was gonna potentially start, but we'll find out timing today. HVAC on in unit yeah. two is completely done, I think. Okay. And a lot of the plumbing in unit two is done. But unit one has an inspection on the ground floor on Oh right. Thursday. Okay, so we have an inspection coming up. The plumbing inspection. The plumbing inspection. So we actually have to drop off plumbing supplies and we had to hustle to get a bathtub last week. Yeah, last minute we had to get a bathtub, so that is what is up at the two flats. Jack Hammer. Yeah, so we will show you what's been going on. I wore my blue coat specifically to match. match that monstrosity. Ugh. Keeping it classy. Scott. Scott. <laughs> hey, Scott. Oh, there you are. <laughs> All right, so one of the biggest challenges that we are trying to figure out is how to make the front porch roof line interesting, but still watch out for the windows. Yeah, there's a lot of windows. Here, let me turn you around. And so basically right there was the old porch roof. And we want it to sort of like have more of a little pitch right here but we'd be fighting with the windows up top. Or the small window to the left of the door. Oh. So it's just a lot of shimmying. We may end up having to move that little window. Um, that's why we're having this meeting. Just for fun. This is what the back of the house looks like. Right, for yep. fun. For fun. <laughs> We're in. Nice. She's in place and she's beautiful. Thing. Yeah, it's you know it's banged up, right? I mean, we're right gonna. There. Oh yeah, we'll just get it reglazed. Re it's you know perfect. So you're reglazing it cost as much as the new tub. That, but we will have a pink tub, and who else has a pink tub? That's true. Yeah. No comment. the shower that's the toilet and that's the lab over there and okay. then you have another sink on the outside remember perfect yep. I can Little see it sink yeah yep awesome uh oh battery's gonna die okay let's try that again we talked with our architect about um, possible roof designs for the porch and we cleared up a bunch of other things. We saw the HVAC, we saw the plumbing, we saw the basement completely ripped up. But I think we have a plan yes. for the roof line. So we're really excited about that. And um, supposedly we're on schedule for him to be done by the end of the year. To white, white box status. So yeah. drywall would be done, the site's completely clean and we are ready to take over with finishes and fixtures yeah. and all that sort of stuff by the end of the year, which is exciting and scary. And scary. Because it's already halfway through October. No. How? So two and a half months from now, we are gonna have our work cut out for us. Yeah. Weep. Blurp. 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 
Whoa. <laughs> Scott has let me know that apparently since I've last seen the two flat, or since either of us have seen the two flat, we might have framing in the basement. The concrete's done, also. And the concrete's done. So we're gonna go to the two flat today, but first we're gonna eat pie. The and biscuits. <laughs> Outside, we just got here. The outside looks. <laughs> Why are you so smiling? Similarly bad. <laughs> for the last time. The outside looks exactly the same. Stairs. What? Stairs. Oh my God. Hey Scott, do you want to do the honors of walking down the stairs for the first time? Should we do it together? Okay, let's do it together. Hold hands. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, they, look, they this is this. wild. Holy jeez. <gasps> oh oh my, my gosh, it's framed. framed! It's framed! Look at our little cute dad. <gasps> wow! Okay, so let's see what's going on. All right, Scott, where are you? I'm in the bathroom. Scott's in the bathroom. I am in the den, which is this cute little room and that's gonna get more windows. And then over here, that is a bedroom. Here, can you just point the flashlight? Bedroom number one, the largest, or the larger of the, of the few bedrooms. All right, so we come down the stairs and then you can walk into the first bedroom down here. And it's a little dark because that tarp is still on the front of the house, but that window is gonna get replaced with um, an awning window so it can open. And then this window is also gonna get replaced with an awning window so that way it opens out but people can't get in because it is so close to the ground. And then looking this way, so on the left we have the door yes. to get in. And then, what is this? Closet. Why is the closet so small? Because of the... Oh, because of the shape hallway. of the hallway. Yes. That's true. The reason it's so small is because here I am standing in the hallway. And then we turn down here. And I'm still in the hallway. And now I'm entering the back bedroom. So again, um, new window and new window, both of which will be awning windows so they can still open. This is definitely a smaller window. Smaller bedroom. Oh, yeah, smaller bedroom. Okay, um, and then Scott, do you want to explain what's going on either side of the hallway? Yes, this side of the hallway will be just a row of closets, storage, you know, maybe a you know, some sort of organization system. Here on this side is going to be mechanical, HVAC, all that sort of stuff. Obviously all this plumbing that's right here needs to get moved so that it comes down inside the mechanical closet as opposed to inside the hallway. Cool, okay, so uh, now, all right, so the hallway continues. It's like a big square. Kind of around the staircase and the mechanicals. And it takes you, I'm confused. So there, so there, a couple, couple quick things here. So this wall right here is, I think, potentially just a temporary structure, just holding everything up until we finalize the framing, because this is the door. Oh right. I am now in the laundry room, and so this is just going to be a stacked washer dryer. Stacked washer dryer, basically right where I'm standing. Right Here, wait, do can, Halloween. Do Halloween. Like, put the flashlight under yes. your face. That's oh, so no, scary. Like that. <laughs> no, under your face. <laughs> and then over here is the utility room. Yeah, this, this is gonna be, stay rough over here. This will be rough. We'll, we'll probably the sump pumps over here. Sorry, I'm so excited. I keep talking yeah. over you. Electrical okay. panels are here. Sump pump is here. We'll probably just have shelving for storage of things like paint, extra, paint, extra tile, yeah. things like that. So if I come into this hallway, this whole room is now a Jack and Jill bathroom. And the reason, so a Jack and Jill bathroom is basically just one where there's a door, um, there's two doors, one on each side. 
And the reason we did that is because we wanted to have, um, we wanted to have you come down the stairs and then be able to walk right into the bathroom right here. But then if you're all the way in this back bedroom, we didn't want you to have to walk down the entire like a maze. Complete, a whole lap around yeah. the, the central stack of stairs and utility. Room. Yeah, so that way you can just, like it's the middle of the night, you gotta go. You can just walk right out of your bedroom and then walk Into through. Into this bathroom. Okay, and then the one last thing I wanna talk about is right here where you can see um, Old the plumbing. Oh, I was gonna talk about where there's gonna be a little wet bar. Oh, yeah, yeah. So right there where Scott is pointing his flashlight, there's gonna be a little wet bar there. Just and then, like a cabinet with a sink. Yeah, just like a sink a and like a sink. little fridge. And then probably there will there might be a TV above it. And then over here Maybe we like might have like a little um of chairs. Yeah, love like seat. Then bonus space. I think that um the reason that we really wanted to add this bonus space is because I just imagine a family you know, hanging out in this house and maybe there's two kids and maybe one of them has their friends over and the mom is like, go to the den. Yeah. And then this is where they'll play. Here, where's your flashlight? Right in your face. Um, We're being lit by cell phone. It's very flattering. Here, show. Ah! So the den will be this um, great little bonus space where you know, maybe we can hide some storage and maybe have storage benches, but just like have it be this super chill little spot. Little extra. Spot. And also, it's kind of cool that there's two bedrooms down here and a little den with a mini bar because it's also great. Like, if you have maybe like two families that might be renting together, renting for the night and they sort of want their separation. I just think this is so cool. Yeah, it worked it's, out. Like, it just is so exciting. I can't stop looking at these stairs. Okay, let's end on the stairs. I think that's enough for um, here too flat. Here's up from the basement, looking up into the kitchen. That is a lot of changes. The divine, the divine light coming in through the back.